Welcome back. While many Independence Day celebrations have been canceled due to the ongoing COVID-19 pandemic, a Siouxland holiday tradition is still set to take place in spite of those COVID-19 concerns. KTIV's Hava Para spoke to organizers about the annual Sioux City Explorers fireworks show and tells us what that show will look like this year. Every year, the Sioux City Explorers and several sponsors, including Lantis Fireworks in North Sioux City, South Dakota, team up for a fireworks show after the Explorers' July 3rd and 4th ball games. Unfortunately, the team's 2020 season was canceled due to the pandemic, but they were able to organize the much-awaited event with safety precautions in place. It is such a, a, a great annual tradition for a lot of people in the Siouxland area. I mean, it's our biggest nights of the year, honestly. In prior years, the free show has brought in about 5,000 Siouxlanders, so public safety is top of mind. What we're asking for is that people uh, adhere to CDC guidelines. To ensure social distancing, people will be asked to stay in their vehicles and are also encouraged to wear masks. The ballpark will be off limits to prevent large gatherings and parking will be limited due to construction in their parking lot. Ryan says there will be plenty of spots near the Singing Hills area that will also provide a good view of the show. Uh, they'll be also able to listen to music on Y Country 101.3 as they'll be playing patriotic theme music during the show that you can enjoy from your car. Ryan says it took a lot of people to organize this year's show due to the current circumstances that we are dealing with this year. The Explorers are you know, very well known for what we do on July 4th. We felt that was very important to keep that tradition going and to keep that alive. The show will take place at 10.15 p.m. on Saturday. Reporting in Sioux City, Havapara, KTIV News 4. Since the parking lot at Lewis and Clark Park is under construction, there will be limited parking available to see the show. It will be based at the Sioux City Sioux Water Tower. The parking lot near the IBP Ice Center and Clyde's Bar and Grill is finished. They say you'll also be able to get a great view of the show in the Singing Hills area and Cone Park, which is accessible from Stadium Drive because Cone Park Road is closed. 